but you know, TNT just he he formed this whole circle with us. You know, like the devil and the moon is a circle. He formed that shit with us. Him and Eshan were just the type of buddies that, you know, next dude would want to get into that circle. You know what I mean? You always want to be down with Eshan and Terry. You know what I'm saying? And it's like I was fortunate, you know what I mean, to even get around those two and be accepted by them like that. You know what I mean? And uh, through the years... TNT just became so much, you know, a part of the group where, you know, he wasn't really uh, the rapper type motherfucker like that, you know, uh, but he had the spirit, you know what I mean, and he was the backbone, you know what I mean, so he just, uh, he was a street dude, too, at the same time, you know what I mean, and the, he was a great big brother, he was a, to his sister. He was just a just an honorable dude, you know what I mean? Kept kept everything light. He always had a motherfucking story to tell. Always had a joke for you. Always came at you like the realest dude you will ever meet. You know, and it, it, you know, and like you say, it is. It, it's it's not a, so much a tragedy for me like that, like it is for his family. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I always I think about TNT every day. And how his mother and his little sisters feel, and his son Terry Jones Jr. feel. You know, I think about it every day. You know, and uh, I push on. I push on because that was my musical brother, and that dude, that dude never wanted to see me stop rapping. You know what I'm saying? Because you know, I've been through some shit with Eshan. You know what I mean? Where we didn't get along. You know, off and on and. You know, he would always tell me, "Keep pushing, man. Keep doing what you do." And he know, and he know, he knew I was that artist type of motherfucker. You know what I mean? Who really into what I'm doing? You know, and so that was that was my man. You know what I mean? And I'm just think about him every day, still. You know, and uh, he became mm-hmm. a great artist and a great backbone for the whole group. And people love TNT, man. You know. A real unknown Detroit rapper, just like I am. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And uh, every day we're going to think about him and push forward. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. No question. One of, one of the real is, there, is, there, is there any TNT that we haven't heard yet that we might get a chance to in the future? I mean, I wish I could say it was a whole shitload. You know what I mean? I wish I could say that. But, you know, Eshawn knows better yeah. than me. He sound with no better than me. He probably got some shit on stash or whatever, but I wouldn't say it's too much though. You know, no that, uh, that shit on that shit on uh, fuck everybody. Yeah. People just like people need to cherish it. I I was listening to it today and I was just cherishing it again because those are some of his last words on, on the record, and uh-huh. it's a good thing we had him on that record. <laughs> 